Most people think of Antarctica as a vast frozen landscape of emptiness, with nothing particularly interesting to catch the eye. But this could not be any further from the truth. We have discovered recently that there are many breathtaking secrets hiding under Antarctica's ice sheets, including some of the world's largest rivers, enormous volcanoes, and the biggest meteorites to ever crash into the Earth. We delve into the secrets hidden in Earth's least explored and understood continent, Antarctica, on this episode of Stranger Than Fiction. The first thing that many people get wrong about Antarctica is its size. You might know that Antarctica is big, but its true scale might leave you shocked. The continent extends over a whopping 5.5 million square miles, making it almost twice as big as the contiguous United States and considerably bigger than Europe. Antarctica's ice sheets are remarkably large, with an average height of a whopping 2,160 meters. Here's how tall these glaciers would look alongside New York City. At its thickest point, Antarctica's ice sheet is an unbelievable 4,776 metres deep, which makes it around half as tall as Mount Everest. These humongous ice sheets are exactly the reason why this continent is home to 90% of all the world's ice and 70% of all the world's fresh water. That is why, if all the ice in Antarctica melted, sea levels across the planet would rise by around 70 metres destroying all coastal settlements and making our planet completely unrecognizable. It is because of the enormous scale of Antarctica and the astounding thickness of its ice sheets that we know very little about what actually lies underneath in its real surface. In fact, it would not be an exaggeration to say that in some respects we know more about the surface of the Moon than we do about the surface of Antarctica. However, the little that we have discovered over recent years has left geologists completely shocked. Using planes with radio echo sounding technology, scientists have been able to map parts of this continent. And we have discovered that underneath this humongous layer of ice, Antarctica contains the most awe-inspiring landscapes in the whole world, including major lakes, enormous volcanoes and vast valleys. The thing that immediately catches one's eye is the sheer number of subglacial lakes that Antarctica contains below its ice sheet, with an unbelievable 675 lakes identified so far, some of which are extremely massive. The largest of these is Lake Vostok, which is around 240 kilometers long and 50 kilometers wide, with an average depth of around 430 meters. That makes it the sixth largest lake in the world in terms of volume, containing more water than Lake Michigan. Most scientists believe that Lake Vostok is the product of volcanic activity that melted a portion of the ice overhead. And fascinatingly, many think that this could be the oldest lake in the world. In fact, some geologists believe that Vostok has been sealed off from Earth's atmosphere by the Antarctic ice sheets for over 30 million years. If this is true, then life in this ecosystem has evolved in complete isolation from the rest of the world, thus raising the tantalizing possibility that we might discover many new species of aquatic animals and microbial life here. However, there is one major problem. Lake Vostok lies four kilometers below the ice sheet, meaning that studying this water body is extremely difficult and painstaking work, and it might take many years or even decades before we find something consequential. The subglacial rivers are not even the most interesting feature that the geologists discovered in Antarctica. Perhaps the most mind-blowing discovery is something they found on the eastern end of the continent. In 2019, a canyon of humongous proportions was discovered under the Denman Glacier. The canyon, which is comfortably the largest one across the planet, stretches more than 1,000 kilometers across and extends an eye-watering 3.5 kilometers below sea level. That makes it four times as deep as the Grand Canyon and as deep as the Atlantic Ocean. If the Antarctic glaciers did not exist, this canyon would be the deepest exposed land on Earth by some distance. To put that in context, the current deepest exposed land on the planet can be found 
near the shores of the Dead Sea, and the Antarctic Canyon is a whopping eight times deeper. One can just imagine the awe that one would feel if they stood on the edge of the canyon and peered into its depths, with the view likely being unmatched by any geological feature that we know of across the planet. But what if I told you that we have also discovered something even more perplexing in Antarctica? On the southeastern part of the continent, scientists in the 1950s started noticing a strange gravitational anomaly that they could not explain. And when they discovered the reason for this anomaly, it left everyone completely stunned. We'll get to that reason in just five seconds. But before that, we humbly request you to like the video if you are enjoying the content. And by subscribing to the channel, you can also support us in our efforts to bring you more such interesting content. Getting back to the gravitation anomaly, it was discovered in 2006 using satellite imagery and other data that this place contained a humongous and ancient meteorite crater. Buried several kilometers below the ice sits a crater that is almost 500 kilometers wide. It is estimated that this was caused by an asteroid with a diameter of 50 kilometers, the largest we have ever discovered, around five times as large as the one that wiped out the dinosaurs around 66 million years ago. Scientists are yet to retrieve any samples from this Antarctic asteroid, and we thus do not know exactly when it struck Earth. But we know because of the characteristics of the impact crater that it happened within the last 500 million years. That means that there was life on this planet when this devastating asteroid impact occurred. And an asteroid of that size would have likely caused unimaginable destruction, wiping out most of the organisms on the planet at the time. In fact, this is far from the only meteorite found in Antarctica. The continent is a treasure trove for meteorites, with over 50,000 discovered so far in this vast icy land, making Antarctica home to 60% of all meteorites ever discovered on Earth. Antarctica, in many ways, could thus serve as a portal into Earth's geological past, helping us better understand the history of the planet. But the finding about Antarctica that most excites scientists is not the meteorites, but rather its volcanoes, which hide within it completely new worlds. So far, we have discovered 138 volcanoes in this continent, some of them still active, and many of them buried under the ice sheet. The most interesting of these is undoubtedly Mount Erebus, which is found in the far south and soars to a height of around 3,700 meters. Scientists have found that just under the surface of Mount Erebus is a long series of ice domes, towers and cave systems that extend for many miles. These features have been carved out by the steam produced from the volcano over many hundreds of thousands of years. And, quite staggeringly, the temperature within this long cave system averages a pleasant 20 degrees Celsius, or 68 degrees Fahrenheit, making it ideal for life to thrive. In fact, the soil samples collected from these caves contained unique DNA sequences that did not match with any of the creatures we know. This raises the possibility that there are completely undiscovered species lurking within these caves, which are specially adapted to living in this ecosystem. Given the huge number of volcanoes that Antarctica has, who knows how many thousands of such cave systems there are in this continent, thus potentially making Antarctica the most likely place to be hiding undiscovered animal and microbial species. These rivers, volcanoes and meteorite craters barely scratch the surface on the various things that Antarctica is hiding. For example, in 1958, scientists first discovered the Gambertsev mountain range, which stretches 1,200 kilometers in length, with many of its peaks stretching to nearly 4,000 meters above sea level. This mountain range is bigger in area than the Alps, but most of it remains completely hidden under the ice. However, the finding in Antarctica that would most interest the world's nations are not any of the geological features mentioned but rather something that was found just a few months ago. In May of 2024, 
In the northwest of the continent, Russian geologists discovered massive oil reserves. The reserves uncovered are said to contain around 511 billion barrels worth of oil, which is more than the combined oil reserves of both Saudi Arabia and Iran, the countries with the second and third most reserves in the world. You're probably wondering how Antarctica has so much oil and gas, given that it is a completely frozen landscape. Well, you see, Antarctica was not always in the southern end of the planet. For many hundreds of millions of years, the continent existed in a much warmer part of the world and was thus home to lush rainforests, which hosted plenty of complex plant and animal life. So, there has been plenty of time for prehistoric organisms to die, decompose and turn into hydrocarbons, which is why many are sure that there are a lot more oil and gas deposits across Antarctica still waiting to be discovered. All in all, Antarctica is not just home to geological features that inspires us with its scale and beauty. It also serves as a time machine, helping scientists peer into the planet's history while also being a potential gold mine for vital minerals. While the conspiracy theories about Antarctica being home to an ancient, advanced civilization or a secret German World War II facility are plainly false, the real facts about what lies underneath the continent's ice sheets is enough to blow people's mind. Because when it comes to Antarctica, the truth is stranger than fiction.